Rockstar's multi-award winning Red Dead Redemption 2 takes glee in stashing content where you least expect to find it. From UFOs to freaky reptiles, these are just a handful of our favorite easter eggs you might have missed in Red Dead Redemption 2. Everyone's favorite Scientology parody makes a triumphant return in Red Dead Redemption 2, drawing the surreptitious side mission known as Geology for Beginners. West of Hawkside Creek, a fast-talking stranger by the name of Francis Sinclair with futuristic clothes, a peculiar pattern of speech, and a birthmark over his right eye. I mean, it sounds ridiculous, but I'm on the level. I don't have a clue what you just said. He asks you a strange question that sets you off on a mission to find a set of, quote, funny rock carvings. Once you find all ten of the rock carvings and return to Sinclair's home, the stranger has managed to travel through time, leaving Arthur Morgan to meet the stranger as a baby. This is indeed part of the prophecy referenced in Grand Theft Auto V during the Epsilon program missions, in which a cult led by Huckster Chris Farmage dutifully protects. The twelve tenets of Kiflam on the way to enlightenment and empty pockets. Tenant 8 in particular states, quote, Aliens exist and are present on Earth. If you have a birthmark, you may be a descendant from Kraf, the famous emperor of the fourth paradigm. Interestingly enough, Francis Sinclair's birthmark is the very same shape of the one worn by GTA 5's infamous descendants of Kraf. Just north of the N in the New Hanover section of the world map, you'll find a ramshackle house on the northern shore of Emerald Lake. Inside, you'll come across a mysterious sermon that mentions Kakwaba, Voyager of Time and Galaxies, and something about casting off corporeal shells. And well, if the player is around 2am in this small section of the New Hanover heartlands, a UFO can be seen from inside the shack. Unfortunately, it hurries away to the heavens above as soon as you exit the building. A second UFO can be found at the peak of Mount Shan. After midnight, a small UFO will appear in the night sky which resembles the classic saucer-shaped UFO depicted on the Mount Chiliad mural in Grand Theft Auto V. And if the Mount Chiliad mystery from GTA V is any sort of inspiration for the alien antics in Red Dead Redemption 2, we can expect additional UFOs to be revealed in the months to come. In the snowy southwestern wilds of Big Valley near Mount Shan, you can find a large humanoid skeleton among the overhanging rocks of a mountain pass. Here, at Horseshoe Overlook, the remains of this strange, cryptozoic monstrosity have lied for uncounted years. After examining the skeletal corpse, Arthur's hastily scrawled notes read, Found a massive skeleton. Wonder how big the man was, or if he was a man at all. It's curious whether or not the skeleton is related to the incidents of UFOs at Mount Shan, but like other easter eggs of Red Dead Redemption 2, these Bigfoot remains may have some roots in GTA 5. The last one is a mission from GTA 5 that centers around the hunt for a living Sasquatch in a modern timeline. It doesn't go exactly as planned. Wait a second. Is this a f***ing mask? Make it stop, human! Unfortunately, there isn't more to Arthur Morgan's hasty encounter with the oversized corpse, and only time will tell if a living specimen will be found on the snowy slopes of the Big Valley Mountains. It seems as a bit of Middle Earth in the Amberino hinterlands. In the northeastern corner of the map, east of Donna Falls and the Bacchus Bridge, you can find a mysterious hill home that looks remarkably similar to Bilbo Baggins' Hobbit Hole from J.R.R. Tolkien's Lord of the Rings saga. Although this strange little dwelling lacks certain telltale signs from well-known cinematic depictions of the Shire, like a circular front door or a gated garden, it is fully adorned with a grassy, low-hanging rooftop and nestled in one of the quietest hillside settings in the valley. If you make an effort to visit this furtive little Hobbit Hole, Arthur Morgan takes the time to sketch the strange little house onto the pages of his journal above the inquisitive phrase, Wonder who lived here? Is this the craftwork of natives from the nearby Wapiti tribe? Or perhaps a time-honored traditional construction method pioneered by the people of the Grizzly Mountains? The road goes ever on, as Tolkien sang, so we'll have to ride it a little further to find out. Red Dead Redemption 2 will award you a trophy for surviving 18 bear attacks. So what do you get for recognizing the bear necessities? Well, Baloo might not be around, but Disney's A Jungle Book does make an appearance as an easter egg featuring a questionable cameo by Carr the Snake. In case you missed it, The Jungle Book began life as a collection of stories in 1894 by Rudyard Kipling before being adapted by Disney as an animated feature in 1967. And while both iterations serve as latter-day fables, the Disney feature focuses on the story of Mowgli, a boy raised in the jungle by wolves. The Jungle Book weaves tales of abandonment and foster care, themes that are conveniently at home amidst life with the rough-and-tumble Vandalin Gang. In the southeast corner of the map along a bend in the Kamasa River, you can find a giant orange-colored snake hanging in the trees. The dangling reptile is much easier to see by the light of day and is a relative mystery. If you shoot the head, it sways, but most efforts to interact with it are unfruitful. Although you can't do much with this a mobile serpent, it might very well be a reference to Car of Jungle Book fame, whose mantra seems downright synchronous with the themes of Red Dead Redemption 2 and its assortment of anti-heroes. You can't trust anyone! 
check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more SVG videos about your favorite stuff are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.